Hey everybody, it's Chainsaw Reacts. Um, it's officially over. Arrow has officially wrapped filming. The cast is wrapped. Stephen Amell is wrapped. <sighs> the end of an era. It's over. Uh, still can't believe that the show has come to an end in terms of filming. Of course, the finale is not going to air till January. But um, it's pretty crazy now. We live in a world that Arrow is no longer in production. It, it's... It's done. I remember seeing on Twitter Stephen Amell's tweet when he announced that season eight was going to be the final season, 10 episodes, all that kind of stuff. Made a video and I was just in complete shock. And I still am. And, you know, it's been a, an amazing run. We're not going to talk about the bad stuff. Arrow has accomplished so much. They have built so much in this Arrowverse. The Arrowverse is insane. And it's just... And it's crazy how much has happened in the Arrowverse because of Arrow's success. Now, we do have to give some credit to Smallville for being on the air for 10 years and all that. And then a couple years after it ending, Arrow started. But Arrow's success spawned so many shows, so many heroes, so many characters, so many crossovers. It is insane. And we have to give credit where credit is due. And that really starts with Stephen Amell. And then trickles down from there to everybody working on the show in front of the camera, behind the camera. <sighs> I'm not ready. What I'm going to miss most is seeing Oliver interacting with the other characters on, of course, Arrow, but everybody else as well, because he has met basically almost everybody <laughs> in the Arrowverse and has some sort of connection or relationship in some sort of way. Um, it's probably going to be very emotional watching Crisis, for sure, because that's where he's really going to say goodbye to basically everybody. I'm curious to, to know what the last two episodes are after Crisis. The rumor, and it's kind of confirmed at this point, is that the backdoor pilot for Green Arrow and the Canaries, if that spinoff show does take that does happen and does continue, is episode 9. But what's episode 10? I'm curious to know how that is going to wrap up, but it's the final episode, so I don't know. I just want to thank everybody who's worked on that show. All the actors... Everybody in front of the camera, everybody behind the camera, all the, the amazing people, the crew and the production and then post-production, editing, the CG, all that kind of stuff, the directors, everybody. You have done a fantastic job and I'm forever going to remember this show and praise the show and recommend the show to people and just continue to love it because Arrow has brought me so much joy and yes, some frustration, but it's not the point of the video. The point is, Arrow has wrapped production. It's done filming. And now we are in that small window of where we have a couple more episodes, Crisis, and then the ending. And I, I'm just, <laughs> I'm just, I'm curious to see how they're going to end it. I'm scared, but I'm curious. It's going to be interesting to see where we go from here because I'm assuming we're going to be seeing a number of characters besides the ones we know that are confirmed for the potential spinoff if it gets picked up. But I'm curious to see what characters continue past Arrow onto the spinoff show if it happens. Diggle? I don't know. Renee? Probably based off the Star City 2040 stuff in the future and everything like that uh, from the past uh, Flash Wars to past Flash Wars. <laughs> if you get my point... Um, Roy, hopefully, the, I just want to see some of these characters continue in some sort of way, whether it's on the potential spinoff or on another show that's already established and going right now, like Flash or Supergirl or Batwoman, something like that. It, it's, it's, it's just crazy. It's crazy to think Arrow's ending. <laughs> it's crazy to say that. I just realized I said sink, not think. I, I meant to say think, but anyways, <laughs> flubs. <sighs> well... That's really it. Um, I'm just still trying to process it. It's crazy to think that I discovered Arrow when the first two seasons were available on Netflix. And I decided, after all this time seeing it recommended, I'm like, okay, I'll check it out. I'll watch it. And I did. I fell in love. Instantly. And I've been keeping up with the show since then. And now I'm here making a video on the ending of Arrow in terms of rapping. I made a video when they announced it that it was going to be ending. But now I'm here again making another video because I fucking love this show. And I will forever love what they've done for the most part. Um, it's just, it's crazy. But 
Stephen Amell did a phenomenal job. Everybody did a phenomenal job. It's 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 gonna be hard, but I'm guessing not within a year or two. But I wouldn't be surprised if Stephen Amell is announced to return in a crossover event, reprising his role as Oliver Queen to come back because he said he would always come back if they asked. But I'm assuming they're not going to ask right away because if they if when Arrow ends in January, say they announce over the summer, Oliver Queen, Stephen Amell is coming back for the cr no. No. So they're going to wait a little bit if he returns, but it's going to be a fantastic thing if he does return for Arrow. For, in, in, not for Arrow, in terms of a crossover event. So I'm done rambling. I'm done talking. Thank you guys for watching the video. Um, yeah, it's going to be sad, but end of an era, as they say. Talk to you guys soon. Peace out.